Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. Hey, hey, hey. Hey everybody, it's Alma. Here we have a haul coming to you from where? Aldi's. No, it doesn't sound right, guys. Aldi's. Aldi's, Aldi's. I know. I have a few of you correcting me on my pronunciation. Aldi's is what it is. Aldi's is how I say it. Which one do you like better? Aldi's the way it's supposed to be or Aldi's? I don't know. I'm... Anyway, enough of that. Let's go ahead and get to the details. I have some new finds, guys. Let's go ahead and get through it. We'll go buy them one by one. All right, so check it out. I picked up these salad kits. I shared with you guys how much I like these. These are the little salad bar brand. And this is the Asian. You don't really want to necessarily eat the salad uh, dressing. However, everything else is good to go. This one actually seems like it has less um, carrots. And I know carrots aren't keto, but the other thing is David doesn't like them. He so I picked up the Asian, the Southwest salad, jalapenos, pretty little jalapenos. These were 69 cents a pound. Then my avocados, 38 cents today. I got a cauliflower. A cauliflower was $1.69. What a great deal. And I got some green onions. I think these were 49 cents. This was new. I thought I'd check it out. You know how I am with cheese and this looked really good. This is the cheddar truffle cheese. Let's check it out. I did not look at the carbs. It is 120 calories per serving, 10 grams of fat, and it is zero grams of carbs. And there are the ingredients, folks. Too many for me to read out to you. So there you go. Then, guys, I picked up these. This is what I would consider easy, lazy, uh, convenient keto. Um, the reason why, I don't mean to offend anybody, by the way. It's just lazy keto simply because it's pre-made, um, you know, your, your perfect keto would be just buying the ground pork and making yourself some sausage. But I needed some convenience things. We've got a lot going on right now, including having to purchase a new truck. Oh my gosh, the truck went out. My husband's truck went out. So we're going to have to purchase a new truck. <laughs> so uh, this might be a couple mornings before we go out and look at trucks, grab a couple of those and go. We'll see. If I do my meal prep, it'll be great. But I've kind of been behind the past week and a half on meal prep. All right. Other thing is I had not seen these before. There was two flavors. I happened to pick up the uh, olive oil with a garlic flavor. It's nonstick cooking spray. And of course, the macros are great on that pick that up. Again, a little more lazy keto. This is their pepperoni. I plan on making some pizzas. want to deliver uh, one of them to David's friend, John, who is doing keto and he's so cute. I don't know how old John is, but I know he's older than us. At least I would say in his late sixties. And John calls me up, Alma, tell me about your stromboli. And it just got me, gave me the biggest thrill. <laughs> so cute all right next guys this would be an equivalent to frank's hot sauce this is by berman's this was 79 cents guys i thought we'd go ahead and give it a try we love our frank's hot sauce thought we'd give this one a chance this is zero grams of carbs and the ingredients are really clean so there you go two more new items that i found at mine is this right here roasted garlic with extra virgin olive oil stump by stone meal and it is less than one gram of carb here's the ingredients it does show sugar however thought i'd give it a try same thing here is this minced chili with um, garlic this one has sugar as the third ingredient less than one gram less than one gram of carb five calories and it's going to be such a minuscule amount guys that i thought it might worth be worth a try. Also picked up these little guys. This is the um, Stone Mill Carolina Reaper stir in paste and uh, doesn't that look good and spicy? So I got that one. These are all new finds. The green jalapeno again a new find and the yellow habanero. Oh my gosh I hope these are spicy. Here's the nutritional information guys. 25 uh, calories. You hear Bully in the ground in the background. <laughs> make a noise and here are the ingredients guys it does have sunflower oil which of course is something that we don't always uh, want in our food and you know sometimes xanthan gum is even questionable as well as guar gum still give it a chance all right i showed you guys these in a previous haul uh we are really actually liking these these are like 4.99 a bit of a splurge but it is very convenient here are the items that are in this particular package this is 4.99 for for six ounces 
love that okay guys here's what i'm really excited about now you guys have seen my video um in regards to the grilling cheese right let me just show you what it looks like here it is oven baked cheese with aged parmesan this package is six ounces it's 7.99 and it is 220 calories i believe for per serving what is it 120 calories per serving so quite a bit and i jokingly said maybe aldi's will come to the rescue well maybe aldi's kind of has come to the rescue let me show you what i found all right so this is vegetarian cheddar grilling cheese great for grilling or frying only at aldi this is by earth grown again only at, only at aldi so i'm believe i'm beginning to believe this might be something they carry regularly so it says it's great for salads like croutons and as a source of protein for your burger 13 grams of protein let's check it out here it is good through december 29th so it has a really good shelf life there it's four servings uh, calories are 200 per patty each patty is 2.25 ounces so on this little burger it would be two it's 120 calories for one ounce this is 2.25 ounces so i guess if you wanted to cut in half you probably could um and it is 200 calories it's two grams of carbs here are the um ingredients nothing really terrible i mean you know tapioca starch yeah i'm not too sure about that but not terrible terrible so again how many carbs is it it's two grams of carb for one serving um you know what it's worth a try guys so this is the uh cheddar grilling cheese they also had the spicy cheddar which i um, am excited about all right guys here's what they look like i will do a separate video on this for you guys and do a little taste test on it but that's what they look like they are fairly deep I'm gonna give that a try today all right also gonna be making some pizzas so i picked up some of the uh, mushrooms now if you can get the brown mushrooms guys they're a heck of a lot better on keto than the white ones uh, but this is what they had so i picked these up i want to make a little bit of cream spinach if you haven't tried that check the recipe out in the upper right hand corner that will be available to you i got uh, two broccoli crowns i got some pistachios for matthew i who's at school so i try to go ahead and make him a little grab bag um, so that he can take home with him every week uh, or when I see him. All right, so then I also have all of this shrimp and it says it's salad shrimp, but I'm actually gonna use it on some um, rice, some uh, cauliflower fried rice. Got some base scallops for the same reason. These um, are like $3.39 a package for these um, avocado containers. And these are a little bit more affordable than the holy guacamoles. Uh, I don't like the flavored ones at all, guys, but these are delicious. Also picked up some cilantro, a little bit of ricotta cheese, some basic butter, get your carry gold if you can. And they actually do sell it at Aldi's, but I just needed some plain one. Also picked up four packages of pork rinds. Guys, these were uh, 75 cents today, 75 or 78 cents today. Yeah, uh, typically 99 cents. So that went down in price, that's cool. Always love a savings. And they also had the Max pork rinds. Now let me tell you, this here, the spicy one, where it does not have maltodextrin in it, it does have MSG. So you'll see it down here. Yep, it does have MSG in it. So those are probably gonna go to Matt. We'll see, he loves pork rinds, we all do. This is for my mom. Look at that, fudge mint cookies. Also picked up heavy whipping cream. And you know what, even though, these are $1.69, I've shared that with you before. And even at this price point, the fact that they put them in this type of container that has the little pour spout, I love that. Also got some half and half, check out those. Some more heavy whipping cream and a cabbage. And look at these new finds here, guys. This coffee, bourbon coffee, as well as maple bacon coffee. So here the ingredients are for this, which is coffee, natural and artificial flavors. So that's questionable, but hey guys, it's coffee. Let's splurge a little bit. Um, and here's the second one, same, same difference. So I don't know, I might do a video that just does a taste test on this. We'll see guys. So for my milk, um, I do love that, but I thought it'd be nice just to have a pretty container in the refrigerator, a glass jar with a lid, this carafe. So I got me a carafe. This was $3.99. And then I have a puppy. And <laughs> you guys know about Sweet Sweet Bo. And I've got Daisy. And I've got Bully. Well, other thing is I purchased their bed. And um, uh, the bed is washable, the outside cover. Uh, but the guts 
or not. So I thought, well, you know what, this way in case he has an accident, I'm not going to give him the bed just yet. He needs to grow into that because he's still you know, peeing on occasion. So uh, when he grows into that, I will also, I bought two of these. I will wrap one of these around the bed because the contents aren't washable, but the outside of it is. So this will protect the contents. All right, so that's my haul, guys. Tell me what new finds you have found. So anyway, guys, that wraps it up. Have a blessed day. Let me know how you're doing, what you're up to, and let me know about your favorite Aldi purchases. All right, guys, have a blessed day. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday, it's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah. Thank you.